PC amateur guy here. <clears throat> Today I want to talk about something that I find that's really important. I went to all my computers and I started adding a second PCI cable. I mean, most of the power supplies uh, come with an, an extra PCI cable. And I think like recently there was like a big debate saying, you know, can you just use one cable if it has like, you know, the two connectors here, or should you use two cables, one for each connector, right? I mean, uh, this cable here is like, you know, you you can technically, it can go up to something like I think 288 watts or something. But just think of it like, think of it like a 300 pound person carrying a fridge, right? To your house. Obviously he has the power to do that, right? But imagine if there's two 300 pounds um, and, you know, two people of, uh, you know, carrying in the fridge, it's going to be a lot more easier for two people to bring in a fridge in your house versus one person, right? So each cable is kind of like a 300 pound person here. So uh, when I actually added the second cable, I noticed that uh, there was no more black screen. And I noticed that, uh, it, that actually the draw power draw is actually less. So it's more efficient. Uh, you're not uh, heating up your, your PC case. I mean, um, if you have like a, um, a small case, you know, your power supply is gonna heat up more if it's drawing from one cable uh, because one cable is actually taking uh, more power, right? So uh, it's definitely a good idea to add, add two cables. Uh, and I'm gonna do that to this PC case right now. This is the last PC in my in my house that I need to do that. Uh, oh, I'm gonna strap my phone there. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna open up this case and I'm gonna add this extra cable, and I'll be right back. So I was able to open up the case. Uh, and another thing that you actually uh, want to use two cables for that I noticed. Uh, is because like this thing actually bulges out a little bit and this sticks out and it's hard for me to the case just keeps on uh, the cover just keeps on popping out a little bit and there's a couple of millimeters so by adding an extra cable it actually reduces this clutter uh, so you don't actually need any adapters and anything so that's another reason why you should use two of these cables versus one so again it's efficiency uh, it, it gets rid of the clutter uh, which I'm pretty sure that's going to be the case so I'm going to try that and it's just more efficient overall and I noticed that the GPU is a lot smoother now and is using less energy. So uh, if you haven't done this already, I mean this is a 2080 Ti, but if you haven't done it already, definitely consider using a second cable, PCI cable, to lessen the load uh, and it definitely helps the computer. And You should do this uh, as soon as you can. I mean I, I read it on some forums that this one guy, this 1080 Ti actually eventually died after two years. Uh, and the error call meant that, you know, it was just not drawing enough power. So if you use one cable, one PCI cable, it may have enough power. Uh, but over time, it's not going to be very efficient. So it's always best to add a second cable. So I'm going to do that right now and I'll be right back. I was able to uh, <clears throat> open up the case and uh, here's the PSU cable. This one goes into the power supply. Uh, so I'm going to plug that in and I'll be right back. So I was able to get it in and there's like two PSU cables now. And in case you're not, you're not sure, it should say PCA I on the cable head here. Uh, so I'm going to plug this in back into the GPU. Uh, So that's one. I mean, this one's sticking out. Uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna try to tuck this over over here. Uh, some cable management. So that's up there. This one. Try to put this under here. Uh, and actually, before I do that, I'm gonna connect the other cable. The original cable I already had. <clears throat> So this is a second cable. 
I'm just going to try to plug this one in. Let's see if I get rid of that clutter. Okay. It's kind of hard to do with one hand, to be honest. Okay. Let's just see. Let's just line this up. And stick this one here. Okay. So, <clears throat> just going to do some cable management. Uh, put this in here. Put this under here. Okay. Push this under. Let's keep it going. Oh, man. Okay. All right. So, the bulk thing that was sticking out earlier, it's not there anymore. I mean, uh, I'm going to close up this. Let's close this case here. Oh, beautiful. So, uh, that bulgy thing is not sticking up anymore. Uh, I'm going to screw these screws back in and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. Uh, I was able to put this cover back. Uh, the place, place uh, excuse me, the power supply is right here. Put in the second PSU cable and it really solved the, the bulging issue here that I had, which didn't allow me to fully close the case. Uh, so to recap, uh, if you have a graphic card and you're just using one PCI cable, you should change it to two. Uh, and there's a couple of reasons for that. You have less bulk sticking out. Uh, you don't need to use an adapter. Uh, it's more efficient, which means the power, the power supply will use less energy. Uh, and again, think of it like two people carrying a fridge, right? And now you have two people carrying a, like a 300 pound fridge, right? Uh, so it's a lot more efficient. The PC will also be cooler. It's going to draw less power. Uh, so overall, it's, it's going to create longevity for for the the graphics card as well, right? Because you're not you're not you're not pulling too much energy. Because uh, you don't need to. Because each cable would be enough, and it's just the efficiency will will create longevity for the graphics card. So if you're not doing this, I I, I mean honestly, at the end of the day, it's your graphics card. Do what you want, but my I highly recommending that you do definitely um, consider create, uh, putting in a second PCE for like the five reasons I mentioned. Again, create, it clears the, the bulk, the bulky part here. Uh, it's uh, more efficient for your power supply, uh, and then it's it's off number three. It's it's cooler, uh, and uh, it draws the less power that I notice, and so therefore it's gonna. And the fifth thing is the longevity for your graphics card. So. I really strongly recommend you uh, add the second PCE client cable. It doesn't take too long. As you can see, it took me about 5-10 minutes. So check your power supply box and add that PCE cable today. Uh, that's my recommendation. Uh, and it seems to be the consensus right now. So, And I'm just going to conclude my video by just closing this off. Uh, all right again. So just watch this now. There's no more bulk. I'm just and put this like this. And look at that. Bang on. No bulk. Nothing sticking out. Uh, and it's it's perfect. So um, I'm just going to set this PC up and I'll be right back. So I'm back uh, and I did get rid of the, the little bulging part here that was sticking out. And it was pushing the key. This cover out sometimes I always have to put it back on but now it just snaps on and there's no bulge here so very easy way to get rid of that bulge so your case can close uh, when you use two PC cables from one cable I mean two PC or two PC connectors from one cable it creates that bulgy spot there so another really good reason just to finally I got rid of that bulge and I don't have to uh, spend any extra money so Really happy about that. Um, I hope this video helps someone. And um, you know, thanks for watching. Uh, have a great day.